Hi, Dita Irvin here, and in this video I will show you how to add a zip file to your blog for downloading. I will demonstrate how you can do this through your file manager of your website. And for this demonstration, I will use my demo blog Dita Help Me and a demo zip file called Zip File Demo. As well, I will show you how to zip any file in your computer. So let's go into my computer and create a zip file. So here I am in my folder Dita Help Me on my computer and I have three files in here. One is a PDF file, one is just a Word file and one is a video. And you can zip any file you want. All you have to do is you have to right click on the file you want. So in this case I want the PDF and then you have to click on send to and that will open up a new window and you want to send it to compressed zipped folder and right away it creates the zip folder so let's say we want to create a zip folder from a video so we'll right click on it and we'll send it to compressed zip folder and within seconds we will have a zip file of this uh, video as well. Once you create these zip folders you want to upload them to your website and to do that you have to do it in the file manager and so now we'll go into the file manager so I'll show you how to do it. To get to your file manager, you have to access the control panel of your web host and my web host is HostGator. You scroll down and you fi uh, find the file manager icon and click on it. And then select from the drop down menu the site where you want to add the zip file to. And then click go. and that will open up your file manager. In the file manager just click on upload and then oh, let me just move this over here and then click on browse to find your file and I will find my Dita help me folder here and I will find the zip files and so what I'll do is I'll upload this uh, zip file demo so I'll just click on it and that's it it was done in seconds I will now close this window and I'll come back to the file manager and so I will have to refresh it So now in this file manager we can find, uh, see if we can find the zip folder and it should be somewhere on the bottom and let me see if I can move, move it up a little bit and as you can see it, it, it is right here. So the name of the file is zip-file-demo.zip so now if uh, into the address bar if I would add ditahelp.me slash zip dash file dash demo dot zip I should be able to get this zip downloaded so let me try that now so now I will enter the URL of the zip file in the address uh, bar here So it is ditahelp.me, which is the name of my website, and this is the zip file name, so it's zip file dash demo. Make sure you have the dot zip at the end of it, and now enter it. And as you can see, the zip file has been downloaded. I'm asked if I want to save it or if I want to open it with some program. I want to save it so I click OK 
and it has been saved and uh, here is the file the zip file demo I'll click on it and it's saved into my computer and if I click on it it opens up into the specific PDF that I created for the purpose which is just a test PDF so here I'm on my website again and let's just uh, see uh, if we can add this link to a new post and make it clickable okay so we'll go into a post create a new post I will call it zip file and uh, I'm going to say zip file demo and I will just link it to the link of the zip file I'll open it in a new window and I'll add a link and let's preview it here is my zip file demo link let's click on it and once again I can download it so of course you can also add this link to an image so for example if you have an ebook that you want uh, people to click on and download from your blog all you have to do is you have to add an image of your ebook and then link that image to the zip file link so click on media and uh, select the image of the ebook you want people to click on click on it and then insert it into the post once the image of the ebook is uploaded to your post click on the image and then insert the zip link into it so paste the URL of the link here and then make sure that you open the link in a new window now when we'll preview the post the image is shown on the post and when you click on the image you will see download a zip file and you can of course save it if you want to download it so as you can see adding a zip file to your blog and subsequently to your blog post is very simple I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you at the next video